Well, the early days of jiu-jitsu in Brazil, I'm, I'm old. I started jiu-jitsu when I was 15 years old, 15 or 16 years old. And I started because the uncle of my first girlfriend was a black belt from Carlson Gracie. I went to a barbecue for the first time and I thought I was short and stocky. I said, man, you gotta start training jiu-jitsu. I have a previous experience with other martial arts before, but when I really actually went there, and the next day, I just never stopped it. That was that was it. It was something that came out pretty well. Mm -hmm. But initially, it was was a, the group of guys that was not many people doing it. There's not a lot of people doing jujitsu, you know, when I started. Mm -hmm. um, I went to straight from to Carson Gracie School, and it was highly competitive environment so it's it's all training for competition and pretty soon i i was seeing myself competing and and, and not pursuing a career but i just fall in as a, one of the team members that forced me to you know to evolve in competition this whole thing was oriented for that yeah there was a couple way a couple times that i knew it and they're still you know always finding cycling you know, how to be motivated on training and the pursuing of the goals of what a jiu-jitsu brings to me. One thing I know that I would, I would never stop it. But before that, I learned so much and so many lessons, you know, that, that, that's applied to life. So I knew of that it doesn't really matter if I'm on a match competing or training or not, jiu-jitsu was for me a a philosophy.